Well, hello, uh, Bronco Nation. Uh, it's uh, Adam here again, doing a final uh, review of the uh, Wicked Relics uh, pack horse for the four-door uh, Bronco. Um, as you remember from before, I tried the flat one that sat um, against the floor and then now decided to um, swap that out and go with the one that sits on top of my drawer system. So I put the drawer system back in and um, a couple other things. So I'll be showing you that today. Um, not sponsored at all, nothing was given to me free, um, nothing to disclose, just purely just trying to share um, you know, my experiences as I experiment and uh, figure out the best way of building this thing out and uh, making it where it's the most functional as possible while also making sure it's quiet, not rattling, and um, just a solid product. So anyway, let's take a uh, look. Again, Sasquatch package. Um, see a few things I've already done, but we'll, uh, we'll take a look now, see what we got here. Right. So this is it installed um, on top. You can see I put a hook road um, top rack in here to get a bunch of stuff um, out of my way on a daily basis. Um, got my Bronco um, standard drawer system um, back in here. So I got all my stuff organized um, in there. Um, I went ahead and um, built a custom uh, one inch platform of plywood and put that in here then covered it with carpet um, just using spray glue worked out um, great at that prior and then um, and then here you can see the pack horse so I'm gonna put the phone down here for a second and see if I can do this with one hand but I don't think I can but we'll see there you go you can so both sides have to be unlatched um, but anyway this thing comes all the way out you can see I got a, uh, a suitcase on here uh, going out of town tomorrow so we've got a suitcase um, already inside of here, but I will go ahead and remove that. Um, this is a, about, a, about a 70 pound suitcase in there, um, traveling for a convention. Um, but anyway, you can see um, you know, what we got here and everything already um, you know, broken in a little, a little dust in here. And, um, and again, just, uh, just a solid uh, product. Um, step back to you see full, uh, full fit and form there, kind of how it sticks out. And um, right now it's completely locked in place. So. Um, you can't go in, nothing can happen. Uh, you put your weight on there. Um, certainly a lot of functionality to that aspect of it. And um, then obviously, uh, you know, slides all back in. Um, doesn't rattle at all. I had a bunch of issues with rattling and some other things in here um, prior, but, uh, but have this thing um, in here now uh, properly. And it's just, uh, just solid. Um, you know, a lot larger brackets than um, you know, what I've seen in some others. So uh, works well. And I love the double sided uh, latch system. I think that's a huge advantage over what I was uh, doing before. I just think it gives you more security and um, flexibility. Of course, now I have to use two hands, so hold on one second. So just did a double uh, fingers on both sides, got the latches in, just easily it slides. Obviously, give it a little hard push and both sides obviously automatically lock in and you're good to go. Again, I kind of layered this up where I have three systems. Um, obviously, my bottom secure system, um, which is organized, etc. System where I put all my day-to-day -day luggage, etc. And then up here is where all my tow and other gear is in different bags, um, obviously inside of um, harnesses. So um, anyway, that's the way I did mine. Um, great product from um, our pack horse from uh, Wicked uh, Relics. And um, if you have any questions, uh, feel free to post them below. Um, take care and hope all's well.